Okay. This is my game, Avium. And we're just going to take a look at some of the things I've done. I've got a load menu. It's not finished, but um, the surface of it is functional right now. You can go back. It goes back to the main menu. We have an option menu. Music plays as well. Uh, of course, there's no options right now. So we're just going to go back and we're going to go ahead and start. Uh, got a loading screen here with some text uh, pertaining to the story. An image, of course. And loading bar. Uh, Loading across like that is, of course, just superficial. It doesn't actually load while the animation is playing. Um, technically, right now, it's loading uh, the new level. And should be any second. Okay, so this is my first level so far. This is your apartment when you, uh, whenever you want to start a new mission, you'll come here. Eventually that'll be functional. And that text at the bottom is supposed to go away. We'll fix that. I've got a little cinematic going here. FPS drops a little bit because of um, all the detail. I'll figure that out eventually. But yeah, this is uh, this is lower Avium. Right now, I have to work on uh, AI as well. Um, it's very simple right now. He does take damage. And text in the upper left says enemy slain. Uh, we'll figure out how to do an actual death animation. Um, but as, as far as his animations, they pretty much mirror my own. Uh, the character you play, Jake. So he has all the, uh, the moves I can do. And I would like to showcase that eventually. Uh, him using all the moves, including flying. Because uh, as an opponent, Hazmat is basically just as good as Jake, if not better. But he's more of like the dark side of Jake. Um, he's everything Jake could potentially be if he um, if he lost his mind. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna try to do some wall running. Hopefully, it won't glitch out this time. And as long as you're, uh, uh, geez. as long as you're pointing toward the wall and have the jump button held down, he'll continue forever. Um, one I'm trying to figure out is going up. Uh, he can go up. A little awkward looking, but it's just a test. He'll stop after a while, so I have to figure out how to. Yeah, there's that awkward angle. He'll stop after a while. Maybe that works, maybe it doesn't, I don't know. Uh, got a second echo there. Kind of a glitch. Got some night vision going on. Kind of really simple. It's not an actual night vision, but it works for what I want right now. Um, let's see. Got this kind of club. It's called Heaven and Hell. You can always kick back at heaven and hell. Here in the neon haven, fleshers and cogs are united, are one, united in their pleasures, far from the troubles of Avium. Uh, made that image too. This one should take less time to load because it's a smaller map that it's loading. Um, 
So we'll take a look there. Uh, I'm pretty much using demo levels to just kind of showcase what what I want for uh, my levels. I'll add on to these with my own little twist. Uh, but yeah, uh, you can imagine what what could go down here. Could be some transactions. You can relax interact with people. Uh, I'll make these doors functional so you can go down the hallways and stuff. Uh, but yeah, I'm liking, uh, I'm liking the atmosphere here. Uh, I gotta figure out a way to make, well maybe, maybe I won't add this, but I kind of would like to see it done, is uh, adding a function to where, um, the character is forced to slow down, kind of forced to walk throughout the whole map. Uh, I don't know, maybe maybe that works, maybe it doesn't. I don't want to take away too many freedoms from the player, but at the same time, I, I don't want them to rush through uh, potential uh, loot areas where you can find loot. So. Uh, And then we have a different loading uh, screen. All right, I wanted as many diverse ones as possible, just so that way things don't get repetitive. Uh, so now we're going back to the main open world, which is gonna take a long, uh, longer time to load, uh, but that's because it's a bigger map, more details. Uh, I can only imagine it'll be longer to load with all the AI and um, details and people and things you can interact with once that's all added in. But uh, this is just to show my progress so far, what I have. <clears throat> and uh, now I'm going to show a little bit more what the world looks like. It's not finished yet, obviously, but uh, there are some buildings that that look pretty cool, I think, that I would like to show. Yeah. Okay, here we go. So, just really quick, this is all part of Lower Avium. <clears throat> Lower Avium. From our apartment to the kind of desert where we fight Hazmat to this area here. Basically, I want this to be kind of a ghetto area, uh, hence the title, Lower Avium. Uh, the fog and rain and all that stuff uh, it plays into kind of the atmosphere and what what to expect in this area this is where you'll mostly be doing all of your uh, your crime fighting and um, your missions uh, but there are there are other uh, other things to do on this side of town uh, central avium uh, Yeah, again, the frame rate is dropping because there's so much detail. Uh, one of these buildings I actually built, um, like most of the stuff you see here is, is asset or assets and uh, um, didn't require too much planning and detail. Uh, this is another, um, another kind of pre-made demo map. Ah, uh, geez. I, if you saw that, that's a bug I'm still trying to figure out. Uh, for some reason, when my character is flying for a long period of time and then they head down at just the right angle and they stop flying, uh, eight, eight, eight times out of ten they'll flip upside down, which is really annoying. Not sure how to solve that. Let's see if I can do it again. Yeah, 
Let's see. This is probably the most annoying thing I've come across in uh, my world building. And I'm, I'm pretty sure it's somewhere in the locomotion um, animation blueprint, but I have no idea what to do for that. So, I mean, <laughs> maybe it could work at some point. Nah, I think it's really annoying. But anyway, it's a quick solve. You just fly again and um, yeah. Anyway, this is another kind of demo map that I'm using as a just kind of a a placeholder. I'll, I'll be using some gas stations. They'll be called recharge stations because uh, in my world they they don't use gas anymore. Um, got some decals on buildings. Uh, let's see. Uh, oh, so we also have pause menu. Uh, kind of the same as the beginning. Go, well, go back. Um, save doesn't really work. And yeah, just wanted to show that. And oh yeah, we also have uh, fast travel. So these are all the areas the player can travel to. Um, however, what I want to do is, as the player progresses through the game, certain areas will open up to them. So they won't get all of these from the start. They will, um, they'll have to gain experience and experience the story as a whole, and then these areas will open up to them. But for the purpose of this video, um, I just want to show the different areas uh, that are currently in work. Got some street lights here. Eventually the cars will be functional. We've got some lighting issue here, that, that flashing I have to figure out. Uh, probably one of my favorite areas is coming up here, the Badlands. Um, let's see. That text is supposed to go away. Yeah, this is it, uh, the Badlands, so far. So, without revealing too much of the story, this is another major area where players will um, get missions from different NPCs and uh, kind of explore different areas, gain loot. Um, really big area. You, you can find a lot of loot out here. Speaking of which, there is an area out here that will have plenty of loot for the player, and it's another personal favorite. kind of gets more lush as you move deeper into the jungle. Jungle, forest, whatever you want to call it. And yeah, you can go off the beaten path and kind of do your own thing here. I think there's a meadow up here. Uh, oh, dang. That's funny. Um, yeah, there's an Air Force base that is not finished yet, but uh, this is where another mission takes place some cool stuff out here. 
Uh, another favorite is... Uh, oh, uh, wrong place. Well, this is Upper Avium. This is kind of the rich side of town. Everything is either white or black, gray, very shiny. Um, this is another side of town where... Um, so, to give some background, uh, you're a vigilante. You know, you, you fight crime. But on this side of town, vigilantes are outlawed, and I think I might restrict players to walking. Um, you know, if you jump or try to fly, uh, the authorities might, well, they, they won't might, they will catch you. Um, and maybe it'll be, game, be, uh, be a game over. I don't know, I, I have to figure that part out. But I'm gonna show something else that happens in this area when for instance, you do try to fly too high or fly to that thing that is basically a defense, um, a defense saucer. But for right now, let me just kind of see if the worlds load the way I want them to. I kind of have a string of worlds that um, are in place here. And it doesn't look like it will. Okay. Well, we can go back and do that thing that I was saying. Um, first off, let me see if this world is, uh, if this map is loaded. Oh yeah, frame rate drops by a ton right here. Yeah, that's crazy. So I think uh, I think it should load. I have so many maps. Uh, it's it gets yeah okay cool. As as I go on, um, I'm gonna clean up some things and make it more official. But it'll probably be a few months down the line to a year. I'm thinking. Let's see. This is a fairly small map, so it should load right about now. Or not. Oh, okay. So we got an issue there. Let me see. I probably didn't have the uh, loading screen set up to open the next level. But um, let me just explore a different side of, uh, of Avium. So we've seen the Badlands, we've seen the forest, uh, Upper Avium, but we haven't really explored uh, some of the other buildings you can enter into. Right now I have two others that um, take you to a different map. Um, and we'll see what those are about. I should get recording. Oh, okay. So what I wanted to show originally was this area here. And it's not loading. Okay. Well, actually, we'll leave that for another time. Oh, 
seven, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Fire. So actually, that missile is supposed to launch, and it didn't. Disable scanning. Scanning. Pretty much it.